Christina and welcome to Life in Synergy. And evidenced by my dirty hair and my huge sweatpants and um, my red nose from crying on the train this morning while I read a lousy novel, I obviously am menstruating. <laughs> and I thought it'd be really great to show you a few things that you could do to relieve some of the cramps that I, maybe like you two, are suffering from today. So the first thing is make sure that you get in some walking. And don't walk fast, just a light walk. Um, good to distract your mind when you're overthinking today and also just good to move. And then after you walk, you could put on some of your sappy favorite sappy music or um, a bad chick flick, anything that's gonna help you release your emotions. Um, and we're gonna do just a little stretch. So I have really uh, flexible hips, but when I have my period, I like to sit up on a block because you want to release the ligaments around your hips. So very important to sit up on something regardless of your flexibility and let your knees just drop out to the sides. So you're opening this front part of the hip and relaxing that ligament in the front of the hip and the muscles all through the front of the hip here. And then just start with some easy breathing. So we're just gonna inhale. And when you inhale, I want you just to expand your belly down. So you just let it relax down. And then exhale and pull it in slightly. And inhale and really just let your belly drop. You don't have to think about putting breath into your belly, just let your stomach drop. And then exhale and release. And one more time, inhale and let your belly just drop. And again, you're just letting all of this relax nice and easy. And let this just hang here. So not a position we would normally be in, but I just want you to not force it, just let your stomach hang. And we're gonna release the tension right here in your neck. And this is an um, acupuncture point. This is the gallbladder meridian that really controls all of the ligaments and tendons in your body. So I want you to just press the hands down to the floor and drop your head to one side so you're releasing it. And inhale up and press the hands down to the floor. Exhale and drop your head to the other side. And release it up. Exhale and drop and let that belly go. And lift up. Exhale. And release. And you can do that a few times side to side. And what you're doing then is you're using the Chinese medical principles to let the ligaments and tendons in your body completely relax. And you can repeat this a few times and then let your block go and just come, put it off to the side, and then just come flat down onto your back. And with your knees bent, I want you to just do a rolling massage for your spine. So you're gonna tuck in the stomach and really release the spine down to the mat, and then release it out. And tuck it in and press, and release it out. And one more time, tuck it in and press. Keep it there, release the arms out to the side, cross the right top leg over, and bring that knee all the way down, big exhale. And really think about pushing the knee open, pulling the shoulder back, so you're releasing this all through the front. And then come all the way up. Move the ankle out, and you're gonna exhale and press that knee away. Again, you're releasing everything in here, deep in the hip joint, releasing the hips. And release, and again, you can go a few times in and out. Use your breath to exhale and then come back to center. Again, roll those hips in and release them out. Hopefully you've got like a really bad chick flick, flick playing at the same time, so you're crying a little bit because letting your emotions go is so important. And then the same thing on the other side. Cross that knee over and pull it all the way down. And you can see how this really opens up this whole side and lets that whole thing relax. You could let the arm go overhead feels so good just to let this go. And then come to center and then release the hip out by pressing that knee away. And then end just by bringing those knees into your chest and give yourself a little hug. And when your knees are in, roll the hips to one side and then release it and roll to the other. So all of these exercises are so simple. The stretches are so simple. The important thing is to just relax with them 
and keep breathing. And afterwards, maybe go hit the Ben and Jerry's. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you feel better. My cramps feel a little better. I hope yours do too. Have a great day.